It's the final season. Yes. What are you most excited about for this to finally air and have the fans see it? What's the most exciting part about that? Uh, it's exciting for people to finally see it. It's exciting that it's something that people love and are invested in and you know have waited for. And so uh, I'm really looking forward to that reaction. I'm also really sad because we're done. So it's mixed. What, what was it filming that last scene on that last episode? Was it just emotional for everyone? It was, but it doesn't feel real until it airs. You know, it doesn't feel done because we get to be together and promote and all that kind of stuff. So it was wonderful, but it wasn't It wasn't as sad because we're not done and I'm in denial. Right. You're not done done. Right. Very sad. I'll never see you again. Shut your face. Hold. What was the best part working together then? Well, we developed a really strong... We're best friends. Yeah, we're best tell. friends. Yeah. Right? 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 Am I your best friend? Are your best friend? <laughs> right? Um, oh, come yeah. on with your no, you make it better. Aw, she always leaves. So is she really your best friend, though? Yeah. If, she no, she if she's really leaving is. you? I see her a few times. I know. Uh, we see each other a few times a week. We have we spend Christmas together. We have family dinners every Sunday. We're, yeah, we're fucking... Is, is the family dinner the two of you? We're not live. We could edit this. Okay. We're fine. We're good. Are the family dinners, is it the two of you, the whole cast? It's, it's just us and her boyfriend. Okay. Um, and then now I have a boyfriend, so he's been invited into the fold, which Ooh, is very... So was there a hazing period for your boyfriend, then? It was first we did like a non Sunday is the dinner date, so we just did like a normal weekday, uh -huh. and then gradually bring him into the actual Sunday yeah, dinner. Exactly. Yeah, totally. yeah. So going back to episodes, going on social media when the show is airing, people are tweeting about it. What are some like the most gratifying things people are saying about you, your character, or your show that really oh, sticks in your heart with you? I, it's less when it's about me. I really I love when people acknowledge David and Jeffrey, the guys who created it. Um, they are so so good and whenever they're recognized on any platform in any way I feel such a sense of pride and excitement and they just they deserve you know they're behind the camera they don't get as much they just deserve every ounce of everything positive mm -hmm. they're not only so good at what they do they're also just really kind so I just I want everyone to always say amazing things Absolutely. about them I, I was talking with Matt LeBlanc earlier and he was saying one of the parts that he loved was that there would be like some little uh, references to like friends and Ross and Rachel yeah. and their relationship what was it like for you were you a friends fan back in the day it was crazy for me to get this job because I was super intimidated by Matt and by David and Jeffrey, our creators, and my character is supposed to be very confident, and so I had to act <laughs> like I was confident, and it was it was it was hard. The first season was really hard for me, um, and then they're so lovely that you know I eased in. But yeah, I was a massive fan. They're so good. Let's be real. So, how many times did you call Matt Joey? I didn't. What? I didn't. For you. High five yeah. On <laughs> high five on that one. Also, because I met him as Matt. You know what I mean? Like I, so, yeah. Right, right. And awesome. his character is Matt, so it's a very easy. <laughs> true, true. Yeah. Only known as, as Matt now, then. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you so much. Thank Good you. luck. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes. Thank you.